everyone and welcome back to another YouTube video. Happy December! Woo! I'm very festive with my red nails and my green jumper. I hope you are too, wherever you are in the world. Today we're going to be doing a build challenge and this is a build challenge created by Sims 4 Ideas over on Twitter where they've created a December build challenge. So it's called hashtag des... De des build 22. I'll, I'll leave it all linked down below for you. It's great to get people creative during December. I mean, December can be a crazy month for everyone, so I totally understand. But with these kind of challenges, it just gives you something creative to do every day to get you by December and just to get us closer into Christmas. But with this challenge, what you're meant to do is meant to create a three by three room. So in that three by three room, you're meant to do something relating to the theme that you pick. So I just randomly generated this number and we got clutter if you can. So I'm just working on like a small little lounge area. A uh, very cozy vibe. I kind of wanted it to be Christmas vibed, but in the end it didn't really turn out very Christmassy. It's still a very kind of modern aesthetic. Um very kind of like moody vibed in that room. But again, this is all about clutter. So I just went crazy, okay? There is no pack restrictions for this particular, um, I guess, day that I picked. I think this was number 18 or something. So in this one, I'm using all the packs available and I'm creating this small little lounge area, this kind of like cozy nook, but you, you will see. Maybe you've already seen it on Twitter actually because I posted this picture a while back, um, I, I haven't just built this, I built this a couple of weeks ago actually. But I just was really interested in this kind of challenge where, you know, you just pick a random thing and you just do it. And it's small, it doesn't take too much out of your time, you know. I know how December can be very busy and I know myself, I'll be working extra now as well at work. It, December can be very busy, but this still kind of gives you something to do. Just a little task, you know, a day to do if you wanted to. Obviously you don't have to. <laughs> but I'm going to leave the challenge linked for you down below because it can be a very nice way to distract yourself I don't know maybe you're not looking forward to Christmas really much and maybe the whole idea of the Christmas hassle is kind of getting to you and you know I totally get that because Christmas this year is something else oh my god do you feel like Christmas has come so early this year I don't know maybe it's just me but I feel like Christmas can be a very hectic time of the year so with little build challenges like this you can really take your mind off of it maybe think about something else just for that half an hour you know like this only took me what like half an hour to 45 minutes to build so it's nothing too crazy it's not like this massive build that you have to do you know it's something really small but yeah you can see me right at this moment realize oh my god I'm gonna get carried away and I'm just gonna let myself do it I kind of wanted it to be a very classy room but then we just kind of went with clutter kitsch is that the right word we just went all out with these paintings on the wall which I just think is an amazing idea and it's a very very creative way to create a very artsy room I guess um it really reminds me of when I was in college and I had like my studio walls kind of like a crazy collapse um, which obviously for this challenge, clutter if you can, I mean, I clearly can, I, I don't know. I'm going to leave this challenge for you linked down below. Sims 4 Ideas on Twitter, they have a, a great selection of things to do in The Sims, to be honest with you. Now, I'm always talking about that there's so many things that you can do in The Sims, but especially if you're not a builder like me, I guess... With this small little build, I really did enjoy it and I think it turned out pretty nice, pretty okay. When it comes to big builds or like figuring how to, how to do like a roof or like how the floor works or like the layout of a room, I'm not very good with that to be honest. But little challenges like this really do get my creative juices flowing to be honest. I don't know. You know, if there's something that's themed, it just makes you think a little bit more. Whereas sometimes in The Sims we can get into a little bit of a rush. So again, these challenges are really nice to get us out of the rush for... I guess someone to tell you what to do for once because Sims is such a massive game that you can do whatever you want with that sometimes you forget that like, especially with the scenarios that they brought out, I think the scenarios are great. I mean, I don't play enough of them. I just really don't. But I think scenarios and things like that, when someone tells you to do something sometimes, it does really get you to think and think outside the box and do something differently. So again, I just love this idea of this challenge. So I have a video on how I created this half room. I'm gonna leave that link down for you as well. Uh, you're gonna see that um, I take away those two walls for the screenshots if you'd like to figure out how I kind of do this half room where I take away the walls how to make it work how to make the lighting work and how to edit it in Photoshop I'm gonna leave that link for you down below because I know a few people are asking but anyways this is what it actually turned out like I love the way this room looks I'm showing it to you cut in half it's up on the gallery if you'd like to see it up close and personal but as I said how I created this image um, I will show you in that video so definitely check that out after this one but yeah guys that is 
is pretty much everything for today's video. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. Something totally different. I never do builds like this, but I really, really enjoyed this. So definitely check out Sims 4 Ideas over on Twitter and try this challenge yourself. Why not? Give yourself something to do with this festive season if you're bored. Thank you so much for watching this video and I shall see you in the next one.